Hate speech is on the rise, infiltrating our societies, fueled by conspiracy theories, prejudice and ignorance, leading to discrimination, violence and even killings. Hate speech affects us all. It starts with words. We must remember history, how hateful words have legitimized and triggered the worst of crimes. Today, hateful narratives in many forms still thrive, spread by influencers, demagogues, violent extremists of all kinds, and the ordinary person on the street. It is time to act. It starts with words and respect for human rights. Freedom of expression is key, supported by universal values of tolerance, pluralism, equality and non-discrimination. But ensuring respect for freedom of expression while addressing the roots of hatred is no simple task. Laws can be misused to repress opponents, silence journalists and target human rights defenders. Again, it's all about words, how you use them, for which purpose. We are flooded by information and disinformation more than ever before. Social networks amplify communication at an unprecedented scale. They have a unique responsibility in addressing hate speech, through transparency and working with policymakers and civil society. Education for all is the foundation, learning to think critically about what we see and hear, create and share, is essential. Providing learners with media and information literacy skills to challenge those who promote hatred. Through dialogue, the free flow of information and mutual understanding, we can build more inclusive and peaceful societies. No one is born to hate. Hate is learned, but it can be unlearned. It's all about words. We must educate about hate speech.